don't go back. Thomas is a very busy engine. He's very good at shunting. Thomas thinks he can shunt backwards and forwards faster than any other engine. One day, Thomas and Diesel were waiting at the quarry. The quarry manager arrived. Thomas was sure he could win the race and do his job, but Diesel wanted to race to be tricky. He had a devious idea. So the two engines raced the way backwards. Thomas huffed to himself. Thomas was determined to win. Thomas and Diesel took separate tracks to the hopper. Thomas thought to himself. Thomas steamed towards the hopper. But Thomas couldn't see that Diesel had arrived first behind him. Thomas spashed straight into Diesel. Stone poured down from the hopper. Thomas was covered from funnel to footplate in dust. Thomas wanted to beat Diesel. So together, the two engines whooshed away. Thomas and Diesel raced buffer to buffer. Thomas huffed to himself. Mavis was at the washdown. She was enjoying a soapy soak. But Thomas couldn't see Mavis. He raced backwards into the washdown and biffed into Mavis who came off the rails. Then Diesel rolled in. Thomas forgot about Mavis. He was enjoying being the winner. Thomas was no longer thinking about his job. Diesel revved his engine. Thomas pumped his pistons. And the two engines raced quickly away backwards. Thomas steamed into the lead. He huffed to himself. Thomas had to win this race, but Diesel rattled alongside him. Then, there was trouble. Ari and Bert were enjoying a rest at the engine sheds, but Thomas and Diesel couldn't see them. They raced backwards towards Ari and Bert. With a crash and a bash, Thomas and Diesel smashed Ari and Bert right through the back of the engine sheds. Stones and timber flew everywhere. Then, Henry arrived. Then, the yard manager arrived. Thomas felt worse than ever. Thomas puffed over to Henry. And Thomas chuffed quickly away. Thomas felt terrible. He thought to himself. Thomas shunted the cars under the hopper. Soon, they were all filled and Henry huffed happily away with his train. Then, Thomas collected Rocky. Rocky lowered Mavis back onto the tracks. Mavis was relieved to be back on the track. Next, Thomas shunted Rocky over to the sheds. Ari and Britt were soon back on the rails. Then Diesel rolled in. At last, the freight cars were loaded with broken rubble from the sheds. So together, Thomas and Diesel shunted the freight cars as quickly as they could. Finally, all the jobs were done. So the two engines raced away to the quarry gates. And they both arrived together. <laughs>